Hi and welcome to this video. This video is about the artificial horizon in Velocidrone. We were asked recently why Velocidrone doesn't have an artificial horizon and the answer to that question was actually it does um, but it's not something that you'll find in the menus that you can enable via changing something in one of the settings menus. It's actually available only through a keyboard shortcut and it is on the H key. So if I just take off here and just fly around this track, and this is one of our multi-GP tracks, this is uh, UTT1, we actually have all of the multi-GP tracks in Velocidrone and multi-GP gates and flags and so on. So um, you can do all of your practice for multi-GP tracks and racing. Um, but as you can see, there's no artificial horizon here that you can see. So if I just land or crash, crash was the option, and I press H, uh, that's uh, H or H on my keyboard, you'll see the artificial horizon comes up. It stands for HUD, it's probably the easiest way of remembering it. But, uh, H brings up the artificial horizon, and then when you take off, you can see as I tilt my quad forward, or tilt my quad back, the artificial horizon is doing what it should do. And if I just do a quick roll, you can see it's all doing what it should do. So the artificial horizon is in there, it's just not that obvious as to how you turn it on or off. But uh, I believe it's also listed in the keyboard shortcuts menu on the help here. And there you go, H, horizon line, on, off. Okay, so that was it for this video and I'll see you on the next one.